Hey guys, it's Connor here back with another video for you guys today. Today I'm opening up my fifth box of NRL trading cards from my case. Let's see what this one has to hold. Alright guys, as we crack into this first one here, let me know down below in the comments what your favourite card is, what you think I'll pull in this box, if you think I'll pull anything cool. And to begin with, we have got a... I think our first pack is a Club Hero. And today, for the first time in 2021, Traders is through. I'm actually going to be leaving those cards to the end for you guys. Yes, I'm going to be leaving it towards the end. So if you guys want to know what that card is, make sure you stick around to the end of this video so you guys can see just what that card is. Leave your uh, comments down below what you think of it is. Riding start to main spry for the Titans. Now we'll be trying to go through these ones a little bit quicker for you guys. Like I said, this is my fifth pack from my uh, fifth box from my case. However, it is my fifth box in total because I had one um, one priority box. This card here is a 2021 season to remember. It is Josh Mansour from the Penrith Panthers. So we're going to have the right hand side here. Mansour scored two tries in his 150th appearance for the Panthers. We're going to have the total right hand side for the uh, season to remember for this box it seems like let's predict what you think what um what other teams i'll get for this box the next card is a black street art so we will be leaving that one to the end as well so if we pull those two away and we leave that one on top so that will be the pile of what card is it? So, Club Hero, Black Street Art, straight away for you guys. We have got ourselves a um, Star Toon, and it is the Broncos Payne Haas. Been waiting for a Broncos Star Toons. Have heaps of the Manly one. Broncos finally have Payne Haas right here. Number one of 16 for Star Toons. So, that is a good pull for myself. If you guys do wonder what I do with the extra cards and you guys haven't seen the videos before, I will be giving these away as um, giveaways or I'll be trading them with people um, to try and complete my collection, complete your collection and have some interaction with the community. Next season to remember is a Adam Reynolds. On round 15, the Rabbitoh skipper produced a kick, uh, goal kicking masterclass against the Seagulls for the um, the Rabbitohs right there. So, so guys, let me know what your favorite card is down below that you've pulled. This is a Riding Star for the Panthers, Caleb Aikens right there. And if you guys do want a more in-depth look at some of these cards, make sure you go and check out my other videos where I go in a little bit more depth. But as this is my sixth box on this channel, I will be going through these quite quickly. But I have... I'm not sure what that card is. So instead of showing it, I'm going to leave it for the end. Not sure what that is. Nothing on the back to kind of give that away either. But I think I just got a glimpse of what it is. You guys did as well. Congratulations. But I think I'm pretty happy with that card, to be honest. I think I am pretty happy with that card. As we continue on through this box. We have a wild card Boyd Coordinator right there for the Sydney Roosters. Coordinator is an inspirational leader for its club, state and country which is very true. Let's put him there. We'll readjust these cards just a little bit. Pull you guys across so everyone can fit on here quite well. There we go. And we continue on. We continue on breaking on. We have got a, another wild card, Ben Hunt right there for the Dragons. And then a Dynamis Louie for the Raiders Parallel. 
be very cool to see what cards are yet to be pulled in this case and if you guys do want to know what cards are yet to be pulled make sure you do subscribe i have put away a box for the um the prizes for the tipping and the fantasy comp already that card that uh, that um there's a dud pack here that box will be out of this case so there is the potential if i don't pull that legend signature in my personal boxes that could be giving out to one of you guys and i won't know because i won't be opening those packs you guys will be getting to open those packs um for yourself i'll be sending you the packs unopened you guys get to open it yourself and if someone does get that legend signature that is a ripper of a card we continue on we have uh, bailey Sirenin for the rabbitos the rising star let me know what you guys think about what the inserts are this year if you guys enjoy the inserts if you guys would have liked to see a different insert if you guys think that they should switch out an insert bring back an insert whatever you think we have a max fair guy for the um, dragons rising star i personally believe that the four and twos should come back because i do quite like those cards um but the top 10 uh, the top tie score is is kind of cool as well to kind of have that um like you know in your collection so you always remember this is a rising star mitch done for the cowboys um so you always know like you can go back and you can see oh that player scored this many tries this season in your own personal collection as i will do in years to come after my little man has arrived by the time this video goes up he would have already arrived and i'm gonna be like this player was this good when you were born um mitchell pierce south no, mitchell orbison wow that was a long time ago mitchell pierce was at the roosters sydney roosters mitchell orbison down 19 mitchell orbison became the most capped rooster in uh player history uh, most capped rooster player in history for the roosters very upset to see him go hopefully he goes on to some bigger better things we get down to the last three on this one side of the box now let's see if we can pull a white street art on this side it looks like we can we have got a let's do it like this we've got ah, no that didn't work i tried something new guys it didn't work but we have a mitch barnett for the newcastle knight street art right there looks all right looks all right flip over mitch barnett 15th to the 4th 1994 90 game barney position lock for the newcastle knights and then we've got a panther checklist so we speak into existence will we pull a let's say another season to remember let's have a season to remember here we get a wild card will hop a white for the bulldogs as you can see right there again interesting they use the blue at the top not the bottom of the lightning I reckon it will look cool as a blue bottom but i'm not in charge of design and the last pack on this side here what can we get we get a riding star Fasoa Fasoa malawi i'm oh, sorry farmasuli ah for the ray uh, roosters right there so that is the end of the left side there i'll clean up my desk a little bit and we get into the right side all right cracking into the right side now clean up the desk a little bit make so that i have a little bit more room once again here we have got ourselves a dud pack to start it off with a jake Averillo as the parallel insert right there let's move the u up there we go now let me know what you think that card is the cards that i haven't shown yet you guys may or may not have a glimpse of what it is so let me know if you guys think you know dylan brown rising stars it will be there teasing you throughout, throughout this whole video so you guys have to wait and see what it is I don't know what that card may hold we have a wild card group for the uh tigers right there Luke Brooks, Leciano Leilua, David Nopaluma. 
Brooks is a top class playmaker. Luke Chiano Lelua is an impact player in both attack and defense. And David Nofaluva, one of the top try scorers in the West Tigers history. So there is our group wildcard for the box, which is cool. This is a new wildcard group for me, which is always good to um, have. Happy that those aren't the duplicates I am receiving. Um, un unlike the other inserts I have received. Another dud pack right there. A Sharks checklist. Now I will be doing a um, folder review very very soon for you guys. Very soon for you guys. I think once I open up my sixth box for this case in seven in total, I'll show you guys what I have got. Another dud pack here for the first time back to back duds. I think that is our third dud. So one more dud left to go in this box. I feel like you only got four duds per box. This one is a Startoon pack. No, it's not. It is a Bradman Best Rising Star. I must have been thinking about this next pack here. This next pack feels like a Startoon pack. And it feels like it is a Titan Star Toon. Titan Star Toon? No, it is a Chanel Harris Tavita. Warriors, season to remember. The Warriors Young Gun scored one of the tries of the season against the Eels. Right there for the Warriors. Very happy that I am getting these right hand side season to remember, though, because. Getting a lot of lefts recently, not a lot of mills, not a lot of rights. So it will help complete my collection. Which is always good when you are a personal collector. White street, uh, street art right here. We will pop the cards we need to away. And we will show together. I'm saying it is a Warriors. It is a Tigers. I felt like Tigers, but... But nah, nah, nah. Let's go with the Warriors. It was wrong. Moses Umbai right there for the um, Tigers. Maybe it was a Warriors um, Black Street out there. Maybe that's what I was thinking it was. Just maybe, just maybe. It is a Xavier Coates Rising Star in this one. Or maybe it was a Warriors Star too. I just have a weird feeling about the Warriors. This card here is a Warriors Jermaine Tanoa Brown Rising Star. So, Warriors there did come through, just not in the one I thought it was going to be. If you guys know or you don't know, this might be a West Tigers box right here. If you guys are a keen eye, you might already know, but I have a feeling this might be a West Tigers box. Yeah, star tune is Adam Elliott. So is the Bulldog star tune right there. What I do need in every variant possible. So to get it finally is good to see. Number three of eight, eight, uh, three of eighteen right there. With a Luke Thompson parallel behind it. Always find it cool when the parallel is the same as the insert. For myself, that is. About halfway through this right hand side now. So not long until I show you guys what these box kits are. If you guys are excited, make sure you do leave that like rating. It does help out the channel in the video. Here's a Lechano Le Lua wild card. I feel like you always get a group and a um, player from the same team. So Lechano Le Lua, like I said earlier, he's an impact player in both attack and defense for the Tigers. And the Adam Clune behind it. So quite a few West Tigers so far, guys. Quite a few West Tigers cards. As we try to open this one, it's a little bit difficult towards the top, so we just carefully pull it open. We have got a dud pack. I believe that is the last dud pack of the box, which is good to see, which means these last five will have an insert of some type, guys. Most likely, Stevens remembers, as we don't have the full six, I believe it is. But this one here will help out because it is a Cody Ramsey St. George Lawara season to remember. The Dragons Fly scored two tries in his NRL debut. Remember that game as well. Possibly could have scored a hat trick. 
from memory. As we continue on breaking on, got a Rising Star Sean Bloor for the Tigers. Herbie Farnworth parallel. Last three guys, last three packets, and then you guys get to see what I pulled. Make sure you hit that like, subscribe. It is a Storm Isaac Rising Star right there. I've mispronounced his name one too many times for me to try and pronounce it again and um, butcher it. And I, I don't know, I feel disrespectful when I don't uh, pronounce the names right. So I'll just do my best. But then once it comes up that many times, I just feel like it's best to leave it. The next card is another dud pack. So five dud packs here but the last pack guys the last pack last pack luck like subscribe comment below it is a benji marshall season to remember for the west tigers there round 20 the club legend played his final match for the west tigers right there uh david for the tour and now we crack on to the specialty cards guys what i'm going to do is actually do it from the bottom so we have a club hero sean johnson for you guys right there that was in the first pack of the box sean johnson player of the year um 16 games 100 sorry 1154 meters 120 points 243 tackles johnson won the inaugural porter gallon medal as the player of the year he also was named the members player of the year and was the Tackle of the Year Award winner. winner. A lot there for Sean Johnson. So very cool there. We pull the random away. The next card was the Black Street Art. So we'll do it like this. The Black Street Art was a <laughs> Moses Umbai Black Street Art right there. So the black and the white, as you can see. And now the last card. As I said, it was a West Tigers box because we got a... Hey, Lechane Le Lua signature, let's go! It is the um, regular version, it is not the white, no, it's not the white or the black versions, which is a little bit upsetting, but we take a signature where we get it, guys. Lechane Le Lua, right there, number 16 of 16. I can pause that to read that if you guys would like. So, the West Tigers box there with a very cool signature. So guys, if you did enjoy this video, make sure you do hit that like rating. Comment down below what your favorite pack is, what you think about this box, what you think about the whole set in general of 2021 traders. Subscribe not to miss out on any videos, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.